yesterday was day one for Steve Cook lean program and then today's day two really really excited macros are going well I hit a new low I was 181 uh, which was awesome it feels so good to finally <clears throat> my voice my voice it feels so good I'm Batman it feels so good to finally hit a new low uh, and it because it's been a while like it's been a really long time and to me I look the same I see myself every day so I look exactly the same so mentally it's like hard to stay motivated when you're like not even the scales moving so man that person is coming in hot 181 pounds and 12% body fat and by May 5 I should be about 165 166 167 in that range I We'll uh, see you guys in a minute. Cause we're gonna be So, I'm a freaking idiot. I grabbed the wrong memory card this morning and it was full. And so I got to the gym and there was, you know, I was recording and everything was good and I was going through my new workout and I only got like two exercises deep and then it, it just stopped working because uh, I ran out of memory. And I don't normally carry another memory card on me because that's never happened to me before. So. I have the new memory card now. I'm headed to do a, is like an interview or like a podcast with someone I met at my gym. It, yeah, it's gonna be neat. He just wants to hear about like my journey and like what's been going on and uh, what I'm doing to prepare to get ready for this physique competition in uh, in May. So I'm super excited about that. Then right after I have to do that, I have to go pick up Logan from school. Then after I pick up Logan from school, I have him. Uh, meeting for vanity um, and then in between there like doing all that I have to do send two emails back for rank KO stuff um, hopefully picking up two new clients and then I think after that I'm free I'm not positive though so long crazy day I'd rather have this than me sitting around going what should I do but that's what happened at the gym, kind of sucks. So maybe I'll show the work, some workouts or like what I did. I had to do front squats today and I've never done front squats before in my life, like ever, never ever. So it was the first time. It's actually a lot of the stuff in this program, the Steve Cook uh, Lean program is a lot of stuff that I've never done. But what I really like about it is it's very out of my comfort zone. It'll be really good because I've been doing the same thing for years. The only thing that's, that's changed is like my reps or I'll add a drop set or, you know, like you get creative with it and you bounce between supersets or, you know, you do negatives and you get creative with it in that sense to keep keep going and you get stronger. But this is just different, different workouts entirely. Um, lumping different muscle groups together. It's it's just, it's really crazy. I love it. I'm, I'm already in love with it. Today was day two. And it focuses on mobility as well, which is really exciting because I am one of like the least flexible people you'll ever meet in your entire life. It's unreal. So I'm excited, really, really excited to see what this next 12 weeks is gonna do for me. And uh, as far as strength, as far as physique, as far as just general, you know, mobility, how I'm feeling. Uh, and yeah, it's gonna be really, really good. You guys ever think, this is weird, this is a weird thing before I go. Do you guys ever think of something that you did or said and then make a noise out loud no matter where you are? Because I, I really just do it when I'm driving. I'll be like, oh, why'd you say that? But it, it'll be a thought in my head and then it'll come out. Blah, 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 blah. Is that weird? Does that make me weird? Am I a weirdo? Whatever. I'm fine with it. All right, now I'm going. Bye.
Hey, what's up, guys? Uh, I'm here with Joe, who I was just telling you about. We just finished up the interview. I'm there Joe. He is. Joe, introduce yourself. Hey, what's going on? I'm Joe. You can find me at one underscore true warrior on IG and pretty much everywhere else. And we are at uh, Fitness 360 right now, and you you do personal training and stuff. Yeah, like that, so right? I train here. I train athletes. I train um, you know, someone just looking to transform. Really, if you want to do it, we'll figure out a way to get you there uh, and find your way. That's awesome. That's super cool. So if you're in the Tampa area and you're looking for personal training, call this guy. I'm going to link something in the description and uh, you guys better give him a call. You used to call me on my cell phone. <laughs> so I just got home. I have 30 minutes before I got to pick up Logan from school and my 2.30 meeting just canceled. So that, it's not awful. Like I'm, I'm bummed that he canceled, but it also opens up my day to do other things that I've been putting off. So I have not had anything but a Lenny and Larry's cookie today and a protein bar. So I'm about to go eat. My macros for this past week have been 225 protein, 250 carb, 55 fat. My, what I have left for today is 188 protein, 158 carb, and 33 fat. Um, I sound stuffy, I don't know why. It's because the weather, it keeps going from 50 degrees to freaking 75 degrees outside. But I'm gonna go eat some food. I will talk to you guys shortly. I am going to call it there for today and I'll see you guys tomorrow. We are going to Disney. So I'm going to bring my camera and I'm going to vlog that trip to be honest. I hate Disney. I hate it. I never ever want to go but it's Roman's birthday. Instead of throwing a party and having like a ton of kids over and doing all that stuff, we take them where they want to go and he wants to see Mickey. So I'm going to have a good time for him. I hate it there. Where are we going tomorrow pal? We're going to Disney. Not working. <laughs> Try again. Yeah. yeah, at the sports uh, one. I checked in online. You gotta use this as your room key before it'll start working. Oh, okay. Oh, gotcha. I'll, I'll get the game for you. Thank, Thank you, you so, so much. much. All right, we just got to Disney, and just as I said, I need a snack. Roman is miserable and i'm miserable and slogan's miserable disney is not the happiest place on earth it's a fact it's the saddest place on earth real life we got a balloon and it made everything better i need to eat though I'm trying to concentrate and focus on hitting my protein today and then anything i have we're going to a buffet later and it's going to be salmon and rice if they have it, I'm pretty sure they do, or any lean meats. And if I have a lot, I have a lot. I'm not gonna stress out about it. Um, and then just get back on track tomorrow because we'll be, be going home tomorrow, so it'll be super good.
So, Cherish has been very OCD about the kids losing their, their bands, and uh, guess who lost their, her magic band? It was our first ride, and it's gone. And the kids, we all, we all still have ours. Hope you still got yours. And hers is missing. Irresponsible. Disney pro tip. After the trip is over, you get the balloon. It's also note to self, I hope I never have to come back to this place. Help me. We're at a buffet right now. Roman is sleeping. Logan is eating and happy because he gets all that yumminess. She's eating breakfast and drinking sangria. And I got, what? Breakfast. Breakfast sangria. And I ended up getting baked salmon, carrots, green beans, uh, grilled chicken, a boatload of shrimp, and some salad. I don't know what it is. There's nothing good on it. <laughs> but I'm just trying to keep it semi-clean right now um, and just making sure my protein levels are up while I'm here. And then uh, we'll be good to go and I won't feel horrible about myself. So it'll be good. Excuse me, sir. Sir, can you point me in the direction of guest services? Where are you going? Come back. Where's your cousin Donald? Why didn't Daisy meet my son? Stop this nonsense. You're useless. Staying at a pretty cool hotel, but uh, check this out. It's the whole thing is a baseball field, and then over there, if you go that way where those people are right there, that turns into like a huge football field. It's really, really neat. Um, people were just swimming. I'm assuming the pool is heated, and they're probably not from from Florida if they're even if they're in there because this is still too cold for me to swim. But it's a really cool view. Boys had a good time, and I want to end the vlog. But before I go. I wanted to say like, Ben, I was just thinking how kind of like what a jerk I am. Uh, I've been complaining all day, not to in front of the kids and everything, but I've been making jokes like, oh, I hate Disney. And people are like, oh, you're cool. You're going to Disney. And, and I just been like, oh, I hate it. It's the worst place on earth and yada, 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 yada. It's true. I don't like it. But at the same time, like I'm, I am, I do want to say I'm really grateful that I, I can go because I'm aware of the fact that, first off, not everyone's from Florida and can just go to Disney on a whim because it's an hour and 15 minutes away. And second off, some people haven't even ever been to Disney. It feels really good that I can do that and, and bring the kids and we, we can have that experience and I can take them because we don't do birthdays for, for the boys. We take them somewhere where they want to go. Roman this year, he's old enough. He said he wanted to meet Mickey. So of course, obviously we come in here. So. It's really great that we can do that for them and like my parents weren't able to take me to places like this when I was younger. I wanted to kind of call myself out and say yeah I was kind of, I feel like that might be kind of rude of me to sit there and go I hate this and blah 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 and just start complaining about it. Obviously like if I had my choice I'd be on a beach in Hawaii with my wife, drink in hand, after my show, no kids. <laughs> That would be ideal. But we're, it's Roman, you know, it's Roman's day and we're here for him and he had a blast. A couple tantrums, but he had a blast. Yeah, we all had fun. So I wanted to end it on that. Um, just really, really grateful that we can do things like this. I, I just need to call myself out on that. So please like and subscribe. I know this is more lifestyle stuff, less fitness stuff, but it's my life. And don't forget to hit your macros.